the topic for my rpp is drones oi bande kahan hai aa rahe hain aa rahe hain matlab ud ke aa rahe hain good morning mr sahu eggs for you mr sahu mr sahu please respond talking drone maine banaya in the technological context is an unmanned aircraft there are many different names for this aircraft they are called unpiloted aerial vehicle remote piloted aircraft systems model aircraft etc it has also become popular to refer to them as drones air flight is controlled either autonomously by on board computers or by the remote control of a pilot on the ground or in another vehicle the typical launch and recovery method of a drone is by the function of an automatic system or an external operator on the ground the idea of a pilotless aircraft is not a new concept the concept of drones dates back to mid 80s when austrians sent off unmanned bomb filled balloons as a way to attack venice The drone seen today started innovation in the early 90s and was originally used for target practice to train military personnel. It continued to be developed during World War 1. When Dayton Wright Airplane Company came up with a pilotless aerial torpedo that would drop and explode at a particular preset time. And the innovation went on and on and finally led to the drones that we see now. And yet and still the innovation is going strong drone works on the same principle as that of remote control helicopter but its construction is quite different a typical drone is made of light composite materials to reduce weight and increase maneuverability also the composite material strength allows it to cruise at extremely high altitudes They are equipped with various things such as state of the art infrared cameras, GPS, laser or guided missiles and other such things depending on the purpose for which drones are made. Drones has two separate parts, the drone itself and the control system. It is the nose of the drone where all other sensors and navigational systems are present. Drones till before some period of time were used only for military purpose. The most popular drones seen today are of US armed forces the MQ Reaper and the MQ IV Predator these were the drones that played a key role in gathering the whereabouts of Osama bin Laden uses these robotic flying machines are now being used for the purposes that extend far beyond the secret realm of military disaster aid and relief it's never easy to search for survivors in cases like flooding wildfires or nuclear fallout particularly because these types of emergency situations require aid workers to put their own lives at risk moreover most of the time survivors die due to hunger or delay in receiving of medication adoption of drone technology could be a step towards putting that behind us drones can be built to withstand extreme temperatures Plus, aerial cameras can provide better perspectives when searching for victims in areas of low visibility or lots of debris. It can also be commissioned to deliver medicines, vaccines, and other care packages to people from a distance. Natural science and research. The chief advantage of drones is their maneuverability. Attach a camera to one of the drones, and suddenly. We are able to capture moments and scenarios that we've never seen before. One has to put in a great deal of effort to shoot wildlife documentaries. However, now with the help of drones, it has become more or less a cakewalk. Drones are also useful for monitoring environmental details that are beyond our reach. For example, NASA has already sent a test drone into the atmosphere to examine the interactions between water vapor and the ozone layer. advertisement and delivery 
when Amazon announced plans to develop package delivering drones last year, people went nuts. Obviously, who wouldn't? One of the uses for which drones are widely used is delivering online ordered goods. Imagine a world where you can order an item online and have it delivered to your doorstep in under 30 minutes. Various ways in which drones can be used for advertisements. The use of drones for the purpose of military is increasing at a drastic rate. Drones have also become increasingly popular in India with filmmakers, thanks in part to the relatively relaxed views of the authorities. Keep them below 300 feet and away from security establishments and airports and you're pretty much good to go. However, for civilians, it had been recommended that in future, for them to use drones, it should first be cleared for their airworthiness. The recommendation is under consideration by Defence Ministry. However, the recommendation has still not been passed because of one of the most effective counter issue, that is, of the collateral damage a unmanned aerial vehicle can cause if it spins out of control and crashes on human settlements. Till the recommendation is passed and proper laws are made regarding the use of drones, all the unmanned aerial vehicle flying is done with the permission from Ministry of Defence. Eco-friendly drone. A team at NASA's Ames Research Development Center developed a biodegradable drone made mainly of mushrooms that has completed its first flight. The drone's chases were made of mycelium, a fungal bacterial that can be grown into a specific shape. This mycelium was given a covering of cellular leather sheets grown by bacteria cloned from insect saliva. Even its circuits were printed with silver nanoparticle ink to aid biodegradation. This is the most recent event where drones were used to click wedding pictures at Meerut. Far Future Uses Various far future uses are cities, hotels and various such other things can be built on a flying drone. Flying motorbikes and cars are also under development. More of such uses are early warning systems. How different would the world be if we had some advance warning that a disaster was to happen? Each of these will require a sensor swarm capable of detecting tiny changes in atmosphere or surrounding environments. Endangered species drone. These are special drones that give signal whenever an endangered species is in danger. Missing pet drones. Many will pay dearly to find a missing pet. Imagine how great would that affect a national income. Three-dimensional chess drone. What's the fun in 2D chess when you can fly your own knight or rook in for a perfect kill? Hoverbike flies like a helicopter, however it is rugged and easy to use. It represents a whole new way to fly. We created a one-third scale hoverbike drone to test a new quad aerodynamic concept. Our drone will allow you to see and feel just how it will be to fly the full-scale hoverbike and will help with raising the funds needed to bring the hoverbike to market. We have moved to a proven quadcopter design and this is what our second generation hoverbike looks like. Drones should be friendly and approachable. Our drone has ducts around the propellers that protect bystanders from the blade tips and allows us to safely operate near the vehicle. We designed a large payload bay that can be easily adapted for different uses, a real multi-purpose tool. We felt it important to keep drones fun, safe and accessible to as many people as possible. Unlike other multicopters, ours packs down to a third of its size and be easily transported in our custom multi-use bag. We don't think the world has seen yet just how useful drones of all shapes and sizes can actually be. The ducks come embedded with LED lights for brilliant nighttime flying.
ਥੈਂਕ ਯੂ